Several law enforcement agencies were in East Haven today for some sort of investigation which involved the FBI and the DEA, the Drug Enforcement Administration. This was on Tyler Street Extension. NBC Connecticut's Jennifer Cuevas has followed the investigation all day and brings us what we know so far. Details remain limited at this time, but we can confirm the Drug Enforcement Administration was out conducting an investigation all throughout the morning in this area behind me on Tyler Street Extension. The driveway of this business area blocked off today as law enforcement agencies work together. On the scene, multiple unmarked units parked along the street where FBI and DEA agents were seen looking into the back of a business. At one point, agents were seen wearing gas masks while handling boxes marked as evidence. The owner of a popular business in the front of where the investigation was taking place says he was shocked when he drove into work today. It's a pretty busy street, but this is crazy. We're coming down this morning and it's every cop car in the world is down here. He says he did not know what was going on until he spoke with the building landlord. I talked to the landlord and they said it was a fentanyl factory in the back, apparently. The DEA has not confirmed the cause of the investigation, but out in the field, heavy machinery was seen inside of the garage where the investigation was taking place. Randy added he's never noticed anything suspicious in the decades he's owned his business. Everybody else, they move in and out. You know, I don't really know who they are, and I see different names appear on the mailbox. The unknown machines were picked up and taken out as part of the cleanup. In East Haven, Jennifer Cuevas, NBC, Connecticut News.